you'll get to see him over by the plaza, right across from us, right by our new vet hospital. So super smart guys, they're also really strong. So you might be able to see these rocks down here. This used to be a wall. So Charlie with his really strong nose, he actually moved all of these rocks around. So he's an interior decorator. No, we can't, no, we can't sit right there. It's dangerous. Yeah. Yeah. So we're gonna have to pick. Look at that pig. Look at that pig. Super strong, super smart. He's got it all, even the looks. Why do you like that pig? That's Charlie. Charlie. They got a name for a pig. I know you are. It's Charlie. It's dangerous. Charlie and Charles, he is the best. Um, pigs are super cool. Uh, a lot of people think they're dirty because they like to take mud baths. And that's actually to help them with their skin. So he takes mud baths to protect him from getting sunburned. And just like we've had sunscreen before we go outside in the summer. He's actually really clean. Um, he's even litter box trained. So not dirty at all. Do you guys have any questions about Charlie? What's your question? You could raise your hand and ask you What does he eat? Oh, they're going to um, He likes to eat everything, basically. So when we're out on walks around the zoo, we have to be very careful he doesn't steal popcorn from little kids or goldfish or anything like that. Uh, here at the zoo, he gets plenty of vegetables, and he has a special kibble for piggies. So he gets different vegetables. Whoops. You want to take a picture of his toes? Uh, he is around, he's either five or turning six. I can't remember if he's turned six yet. So he has really grown. Uh, when he was first born, he was like a little piggy. And again, somebody brought him home thinking he was a micro pig. Uh, but this is a micro pig. So there's no such thing. Um, he is considered domesticated though. Uh, he is a Vietnamese pot belly pig. Oh, he's gonna sit. Good. So, unlike his cousins, the white warthogs, here you go. Like, oh, Charlie. <laughs> question here. Yeah, what's your question? How much does he weigh? How much does he weigh? That's a great question. Um, so he weighs, right now he's kind of heavy because we're coming right out of winter, not a lot of exercise, but we're hoping on getting him for walks this summer. Uh, so he is right around the like 200 mark. So pretty hefty boy. Wow. What's your question? I was just waving. Does he like watermelon? He sure does. <laughs> So just like us, we like to fill up on snacks and cookies and things. We have to make sure that Charlie doesn't get much bigger. <laughs> so we have a uh, nutritionist on staff actually for all of our animals to help us with sort of problems like this if they get a little too chunky over the winter. Um, usually they recommend sort of exercise and we can also use different enrichment around his enclosure. So this nifty thing. Um, is called like an amazing grazer. So I can find food in that for him and he has to use his really strong nose and his neck muscles to help root around in there. Oh, that's kind of like a pinata for pigs. <laughs> so that's just got to get him exercising a little bit. So we do a little bit of training, get his mind going, and then we can do the physical stuff. That's really cool. Thanks for coming by to see him. If you have any other questions, I can answer them.